Hey La Pavoni friends, John Helk here. I uh, just want to show you a um, way to look at the La Pavoni uh, CAD model in an exploded view, whatever that means. Um, I'll show you. So if you go to this website, https uh, bit.ly.com slash La Pavoni CAD, uh, right there. Uh, click on that and it should take you up to our CAD model that we've been working on. And uh, Annoyingly, again, uh, make sure to click on the very left tab, and uh, for some reason I can't make that be the default tab that shows up, but okay, there we go. Um, and then choose your product. So in this particular case, it starts off with a Generation 2 group head, uh, Europicola, which is a smaller boiler, classic chrome base as opposed to a black one, black grate, and uh, three-hole steaming tip, which is this thing right here. So if we want to look at this in exploded view, you'll look down here and there's a thing called toggle exploded views click on that and a little thing pops up on the right it says explode and my um, uh, best explanation on how to activate this is to right click on it if you have a Windows mouse um, if you don't if you're on a Mac I'm not sure how to do that I just double clicking on it looks like it might work hey there we go uh, and then you can go ahead and uh, look at the exploded view over here. And this is the exploded view of our La Pavoni Generation 2 Europicola boiler with a black grate. Probably most of you don't have the black grate, so you can come over here and change that to be the chrome grate. And poof, there we go. Um, and uh, as you're looking at this, you're like, okay, that's a Generation 2 group head. And so I can go in and change that to a Generation 3. And then you'll see the sleeve show up in the exploded view as well, and there it is. And uh, port a filter over there. And other things you can do is you can change the wiring from the Europicola uh, to the Professional, and you'll see that wiring change. And see now we've got the green switch there. Um, see the heating element. Uh, look underneath the boiler, etc. Uh, just enjoy looking around at that. Um, we also have the. Um, uh, Stradivaria wiring harness. If you click on that, you'll notice the wiring harness disappeared because I have not modeled the Stradivaria wiring harness, so I don't know how to do that yet. Um, but you can bring up the uh, Stradivaria base, which uh, should just change the geometry of the base down here. Um, and uh, again, I never looked inside of Stradivaria, so I still need to work on, on that wiring when I get to it. Uh, Stradivaria um, group head. Uh, we call that Generation 4, and so there we go. Um, there's your Stradivari group head. And the boiler, obviously, you can go to a larger boiler, click on Professional, and I'm probably boring you by now. Um, you might ask, how, how is it that I keep spinning this so fluidly? Um, I just have a 3D mouse, uh, which is a separate USB device um, uh, by 3D connection, and that just helps when you spin around, so that's kind of like uh, a cool thing to have when you're done. Click done and we're good. Enjoy the rest of your day.